there's a few settings we need to look at to actually make the game look a lot better. And I know a lot of you guys are playing this game right now, and it kind of looks like this. Dude, the hit markers, you just know you're screwed. Like, this gun sucks. Bro, nobody's flowing right now. Why is everyone canceled? When in fact, you kind of want it to look like this. Beside you, flat to your left. Damn. So today I just want to make a quick short video to show you guys how to change that because it's something that it's really depressing to look at if you guys don't change. So we're going to go into the settings and there's a few settings that we got to change here. The first one is actually going to be in the graphics, but then we're going to get out of graphics after, which you might think, why would color settings be out of graphics? They are, guys. The first one here is going to be in the quality. You're going to want to set that render resolution up to about 105. Now, the reason you want this higher is because it makes the game look a lot clearer, a lot crisper, and it just helps out with those colors. It helps them pop a lot nicer. Now, that's not the only setting we need to work about for colors. There's a few different ones as well but we got to turn some stuff off as well while looking at that i'm going to go over to view and in view what you want to change is the world motion blur off weapon motion blur off film grain set it to zero and that camera movement you want to put it to the least now this is the most important one we're going to go to and this one's in the interface once you get to the interface you're going to see stuff like subtitles subtitle size subtitle background ignore all that we're going to go to color customization and in the color customization we're not going to change any of these colors here for example unless you want to but for now what we're going to be doing is going all the way down to color filter and we're going to put on either color filter 2 or color filter 3. I personally like 3 better than 2, but uh, the colors when you look at your minimap are a little off, so you're going to want to change this for sure. Like your party turns to like a gold, so you could even change that. You could put it back to normal, so if you want your party to be green or whatever, go ahead and select custom color, and then you could like pick a green and stuff, the hue, saturation, all that. But that's putting it to color filter 3. Once you put it to 2, it leaves the minimap pretty much the same. Everything's pretty much the same. Also makes the world pop a lot nicer. Now that's the, not the only thing you're going to change as well. We're going to go over to color filter target we're gonna go to interface rather than world the interface is gonna look nice you could change the world as well the world is definitely something you want to work on but what I would really suggest is setting it to both now the reason you want to set it to both is so that these colors could pop a lot nicer when you're in the actual game and then what you're gonna do here is you're gonna put the world color intensity to a hundred rather than 75 I think when you get the game it starts off at 75 or something you go pop this all the way up and it's gonna look really really nice and then the last one the most important one as well is gonna be in the graphics we're gonna go here we're gonna go down to brightness in the graphics and then we're going to select this right here i find where that not visible is barely visible is nice and that barely visible is also barely visible so you want to set it's like 50 55 somewhere around there at least on my monitor looks the nicest that not visible is not visible whatsoever as you guys can see it starts becoming visible now and then you bring it down it's not visible and then the barely visible you're going to want to bring that down as well to where you could barely read it and i don't know 55 is nice for me and then the easily visible is number three on the on the right so this is what you want to have it set to this is going to help you out a lot nicer the game's gonna look a lot better if you set the brightness up all the way to 100 it's gonna look awful don't do that guys but go ahead enjoy the nice colorful game you guys got and if it really bothers you if you're playing on a tv or a monitor just up the saturation on that it should help a little too if this helped you guys make sure to drop a like sub to the channel there's nobody turned on my name is nick thank you for watching and i'll catch you in the next one peace